Hello. I have realized I need to record a video today because uh, Imposter Factory probably won't be out till tomorrow because American time. And in Australia it'll be the 30th, but in America it'll still be the 29th. So, therefore, I need to figure out how to make a video um, to fill out time. So here we are. Um, welcome to clean my house. Also, here's the new logo. All right, lighting's terrible. Um, but, just got back from the shops. And let me show you what I got. All right, so first we got gloves. Gloves. Start rolling. Poison. 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 More poison. And bicarb soda. Oh, also got my poison. Woohoo! So welcome to my bathroom. Uh, why we're in here is simply because on these walls, this is a lot better than it was yesterday. However, you can still kind of tell it's all pinky moldy in there. And that is after I use poison. So I was looking at recipes online and apparently baking soda is the way to go. So uh, let's give baking soda a shot. Yep. I got my car on my shoe. I feel like I'm cooking in my own bathroom. Poison number one. Yeah. Time for poison number two. Chuck it in there. Clean that thing. Voila. Let the water flow. You know, or not. Just, just take your time. Yes. Clean, my pretty. Clean, clean. It's time for your surgery, house. <laughs> Poison. Kill it all. I think it's time to rinse the shower and see what we can see. See how much cleaner we can get these grout things now that all this baking soda's dried up. You know, I don't think it worked as well as I was hoping it would. I think it's a little better, but maybe it's just fully stained now, who knows. We tried. All right, so, gonna pour some bleach in the shower, see if that gets rid of any of that mold stainage stuff in there. And then I'm just gonna leave it to soak while I start vacuuming the bedrooms. So wipe over with undiluted bleach. Why, why not? You can just... Leave that to soak for a while, eh? All right, now the baby room. Let's get rid of all this stuff. If only snapping your fingers would clean the room every time, right? This, the, I wonder where all this... Oh. There is a plan for this. Why sort it out now when I have to resort it when I put it back in anyway? So it's all there. Just waiting for it to come back in. But in the meantime, I'm gonna vacuum this and then spray it with poison so that it's clean. It makes sense, shush. <laughs> Vacuum can. Time for a healthy dose of poison. Now that the carpet's all vacuumed, I just shove this stuff on there and then Maybe it'll focus on the instructions, but anyway, you just sort of spray it on there and then um, shake can well. It's basically just... Then... Yeah. 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 Not on the wall, idiot. 
And his phone! And the phone left a smiley face for some reason. Isn't that lovely? <laughs> Quick break, just thought I should tell you that the reason I am putting so much effort into cleaning today is because the kids are not here. The wife is not here. They're all at grandma's for a few days, so I get left with the lovely job of staying behind and doing the massive clean. Because I have to be home so that I'm close to work instead of traveling so far. So I get the job of cleaning instead of playing games. But hey, I'm recording a video out of it, so that's a plus. <laughs> All right, so it's been a, a, like an hour since I soaked up the bedroom. Nice and clean. You can't smell in the YouTube video, but it smells clean. But the most exciting part, I think, of this whole thing, because I've been cleaning this bathroom, or trying to get the mold off it. Wow, really washed there for a couple days now. The bleach, it's made it white. There's no more pink. Can you see that? Can you see it? There's no more pink in it anymore. I cleaned it. It's done. The pink that's been there for months is gone. <laughs> I'm so excited. Try me. And now I'm gonna bleach this thing because apparently it works. And um, clean the other bedroom. Gotta clean the other bedroom. Sort out this pile which was in the bathroom, which is now not in the bathroom, but will be in the bathroom once again, very shortly. Um, clean up this pile, which goes back into the empty bedroom. And then, <sighs> mental note guys, if you have kids, this is a thing. You cannot go out, do a full-time job, come home and be relaxed enough to clean and for the stay-at-home mum that my wife is, you don't have the energy to constantly clean while looking after kids. So the house just, the cleaning just kind of gets pushed aside for a while. And opportunities like this arise where they're not here. They're gone. Don't use cleaning chemicals while kids are around because it's not good for them. They'll crawl all over you. Not, not good, poison them. So clean up while they're not here. And then you get results like that shower. In that bedroom. And oh my gosh, I can't wait to show you when it's all done. <laughs> Final step in the bathroom that we need to do is the floor. So we have our steam mop here, trusty steam mop down there. And we're just gonna put on the steam mop cloth and fill it up. And then, uh, yeah, Oops. get things ready to go. There we go. Let the steam flow free. Ooh. Goodbye, Dad. Hmm. Ah, there we go. Goodbye, Dad. Nice knowing you. Bye bye. See you next time. <laughs> All right. Here's the other bedroom. I've gotten rid of a lot of stuff in it. I'm not going to show you too much of this because there is some photos on the wall that I do not want to make it into the video because I don't want to share photos of my family at this stage but all I, all I can say is that uh, the rooms that are supposed to be clean are clean the rooms that I have not cleaned are getting worse oh so much worse it's things like this why we have to disinfect the carpet. I found an old water bottle upside down on this spot of the floor. Who knows how long it was leaking, but now I gotta disinfect that before mold starts growing all over it, unless it already has started growing on it. This is why we clean people. Cause you never know what you're gonna find. The more it climbs up, the more it tries to disinfect things, so I wonder how much this patch is gonna foam up. It kinda dodges around the patch, maybe because it's wet. But it's foaming up on the sides of the patch, which gives me an idea that it is actually working. Look at all that foam. 
Ooh, nice straight line there. You can tell there was a cupboard or something in that spot then. So the towel rack fell off the wall, so I'm gonna have to reattach that quickly. So, uh, just, uh, just... See, I love having magic bows. It's great. And just like that, the bathroom is clean at last. It's clean at last. It's clean at last. Yeah. And this bedroom is pretty much clean and sorted. I still gotta put a few more things in, but hey, it's it's looking ready to go. It's like a another it's a baby station again. It's time for me to get ready to stream. I need to have a shower in my new clean shower. <laughs> gotta give it a rinse though before I jump in it because I'm afraid of how much bleach is actually still stuck to the wall. So I'm gonna give it a thorough rinse, then I'm gonna jump in the shower and get ready to, hack, to stream. To be honest, this video is gonna come out on the day after I stream, but that's okay, that's all right. You can, you can see it anyway. But yeah, if you wanna see more of this sort of clean video and see a video of me sorting out this, then I need you to like and subscribe to give me the confidence to do that because I, I, I currently, I don't want to do that. Sure, I caused most of it, but I, I, I don't want to touch it. Anyway, let me know what you think in the comments below and tell me if you have any of your own sort of cleaning mechanisms that you do that are quite um handy to know. And um, yeah, I'll catch you in the next one. Keep bouncing, everybody. Bye. <laughs>